Hello, good evening, everybody. Welcome to the class number 17. And uh, today is Tuesday. So, Elisa, welcome back. Nice to see you. Hello. Thank you. Better? Mejor? Yep. Todo bien? Everything okay, Elisa? More, more or less. More or less, okay. Well, I hope you can feel better these days. Espero que te sientas muy bien. Uh, we have vacations next week. Are you having vacations? Vas a tener vacas? Yep. Yes. Uh... From, desde que día? From Monday, from Tuesday, Wednesday? From, from Friday. Okay, from Friday and Saturday and Sunday. And Saturday and Sunday. Okay, well, it's nice, it's nice. So, uh, hello uh, to everybody. So, um, Carito, how are you feeling? Hello, teacher. Uh, pretty good. Okay, that's Living fine. Better. I guess, oh, nice. yes. I like that attitude. I miss it. Ya la extrañaron. Good. Okay. So, uh, Joa, how is it going? So far, so good. Nice. That's wonderful. And Carly, how were you feeling? Very good. Okay. That's nice. Awesome. Oscar. How are you feeling? I don't find. Oh, good. Gabriel, how is everything? Hello, teacher. I am the girl. Oh, nice. Stephanie, how is it going? Yeah. Okay, good. Mardo. How are you feeling? I'm doing all right. Perfect. Hey, Luis. How is everything? Hey, teacher. <clears throat> On the top of the, of the world. That's interesting. Nice. And Rachel, how are you feeling? Couldn't well, be better. Yeah, that's the attitude. Vaya, esa es la actitud, pero Rachel, te veo más sonriente. What happened today? Or yesterday? Algo, algo picoso? Yes? No. <laughs> no, I would like to, me gustaría. Okay. Bien. Salud, Joanna. Perfect, my friends. Just, uh, what? Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. De hecho, que la clase del viernes normalmente ni se siente porque pasa más rápido, porque es la última. So imagine, just three classes. Ya casi, ya casi. Tres clases lo logramos casi. Yeah. De hecho, creo que ya lo logramos, pero vamos a, lo a lograr por completo. Ok. So, um, welcome back. Y cada vez que se acerca el módulo, yo me emociono. No porque ya no lo veré, porque me... todas las vacaciones. But... It's because it's another course. Es otro curso que otro módulo que, que llevamos. Pues. No sé, este grupo ha estado bien interesante. Very nice. Bien portado. A veces. How to use will like to. ¿Cómo usar el will like to? Uh, this is a topic that we have studied before. Uh, we have mentioned some phrases um, or expressions. With the wood. In this este case, um, yo así yo digo, I would like to. ¿A qué me refiero? No sé. No idea. Mardo, what about you? Te gustaría. Yes, that's the way. Me gustaría. Uh -huh. Entonces, el wood hace que todas las palabras. Terminen en IA. Ok. Uh, for example, I will dance. No, esto no. Salsa. No nos pongamos leves. 
I would dance salsa. Clarito, ¿qué dice acá? Bailaría salsa, ¿no? Yes. With you. Okay. Contigo. Okay, yes, that's it. Or I would like, I would dance salsa with my colleague, with my boss. Okay, so um, the, those are tranquila. You are, those are like just um, <laughs> uh, suppositions. Una suposición es que I would like es el es como un condicional, verdad? Okay. Pero eh, normalmente se utiliza I would like to. Me gustaría. Me gustaría. Okay. So let's continue with this. Eh, me gustó. Me gustó que captaron la idea, verdad? Yo lo que les estaba, estaba explicando ayer y se las pongo porque quizás a veces uno viene como bien de trabajo. You have some other things at home, right? A veces ustedes vienen como que se vienen a, a conectar ya cuando están acá, ¿verdad? cuando ya nos vemos y todo eso. Different forms to ask how are you. Cosa que vimos ayer, como preguntar cómo estás. En lugar de decir how are you or how are you or how are you, podemos decir how is everything, how have you been, how are you feeling, what's new with you. How was your day? How were the things going? Y así sucesivamente. Y para decir en lugar de I'm fine. Pretty good. Couldn't be better. I'm doing good. Como dijo Luis, on the top of the world. I'm alive. Yeah. Some other things. Uh, in this case, um, we're going to talk about another keyword. No sé qué les parecen estas frases. Considero que son funcionales hasta cierto punto. Aprendemos cosas nuevas. Palabras nuevas, eso es, bueno, llama la atención, considero. Me hubiese gustado en el nivel básico aprender eso. A mí, pero aprendí otras cosas. Ok. Phrases for describing relationships. Frases para describir a uh, relationships. Eh, relaciones emocionales, no codependientes, sanamente. I'm single, ¿verdad? La típica que nos dice, ¿verdad, Luis? Gabriel, Fredo, Mardo, William. Siempre nos dicen eso. I don't know. Y que nosotros caemos. Amo. Yeah. Sí. ¿O no? No, pues ah. las víctimas. Yeah. Mardo, si ¿sí o no. Luis. Siempre caemos, Kichi. Ya, yeah, caemos. I'm sorry for yeah. us. Lo siento, lo siento, muchachos. Sí, sí. <risa> Mere, tengo un minuto de silencio. Ok, so I'm single. Eh, tenemos la otra. I'm with someone. Ajá, solo que I'm with someone, sometimes you can say that estoy con alguien, pero si eh, no es tan polite, no es tan cortés, ¿verdad? Es como el típico papá de mis hijos. That's, some, that, that's a common phrase in, in Salvadorian speech, right? Yes, o, 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 ajá. o la, la mujer con la que vivo, el hombre con el que vivo. That, there are some phrases that here in Salvador people say, entonces como que bien curioso, ¿verdad? Paréntesis, ¿qué otras frases han escuchado para describir relaciones en Salvador? Compañero ella? de vida. Compañero de vida, that's it. Pero se escucha más formal. ¿Estás, estás practicando, Raquel? Yeah, that's good, that's nice. Yes, um, Carly, any idea? Escucho mucho que me dicen con mi marido. Ok, yes, yeah, that's it, yes. Eh, marido, mujer, that, 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 that's something that, that maybe depends on, on the person. Depende de, de la persona o de la persona. Pero, pero sí, así dice María. Yo lo escucho un poquito pesadito eso, ¿verdad? Pero, sí, igual. Pero, But in Colombia, in Colombia, I'm sorry. In yep. Colombia, that's the usual form to, to talk about the, the couple. For example, mi marido. It's okay. not... That's normal. Yes. Okay. And, and the words arrejuntados. No, here we don't have arrejuntados. Joa, what do we have here? ¿Cómo le decimos acá? Acompañados. Arrejuntados. Yes. Eh. Arrejuntados. Bueno, yo... O sea, es, es una, es, es una en manera Oriente, arrejuntados. despectiva. Es despectiva para decir cuando no se casaron, o sea, como que... Están viviendo en pecado. Con cubinato. Okay. <ríe> Tendamo. Uh, that's a very common. Ya, Raquelita dice, sí. 
Aquí es culpable, dice Raquel. So, uh, that, <laughs> that's a very common phrase. Eh, estar acompañado, uh, arrejuntado. Uh, unión uh, libre. Va, unión libre es una cuestión bien, bien light, ¿verdad? Como para, para decirlo así, bien relax. Diplomáticamente. Bien, eh, that's the word, diplomacy. Diplomáticamente, unión libre. Do, do you know what? In Colombia, uh, we use the unión libre for a legal question. You can... Uh, for example, uh, get a social seguro if you present a document and say, I am in a free union with uh, X person. Also, that's for legal process. Yes. Or something union, when you have to legal. justify something. <clears throat> mm, interesting. Interesting. Okay. So yes. that's nice. Okay. Continuemos porque creo que están recordando muchas cosas que han visto. So I'm single. I'm with someone. I'm dating someone, o oh, we are dating. Este es como cuando eh, ustedes están saliendo con alguien, ¿verdad? I'm dating someone, y hay otro individuo o individua que tiene intenciones, right? De, de, de dating with you, de salir con ustedes. So, I'm dating someone, I'm sorry. Es lo que decimos, ¿verdad, Luis, Mardoqueo? Gabriel, siempre decimos, I'm dating someone, I'm sorry. I can't. So, and here we have we are engaged. Esto engaged no es arrejuntado ni es enlamado. No. Engaged is comprometido. Ok. Engaged. Engaged. Yes, Carito. How do you say estoy con ella solo por mis hijos? Ah. Sabes que esa frase no existe en ningún idioma, Carito. I don't know. Where have you? ¿Dónde has escuchado eso, Carito? En la paja que le dan a uno. Es que se... En salvadoreña habla, pero de la paga. Ok, um, yes, I'm with her just for the kids. For the kids. For, I'm okay. with her just for the kids. Uh -huh. La típica, no, ya iba a decir otra cosa, but yeah, there are some other expressions that we listen, to, like it's very common. So, engage. Si decimos engage, es como como engage, es como, como, un, como un atrapar, como afianzar, pero engage, con T, engage, es un verbo eh, regular, eh, estamos comprometidos. That's, we're engaged. Aquí dice, going to get married. ¿Qué se van a casar? I'm married. Lo que siempre decimos nosotros cuando esto es así, I'm married. ¿Verdad? Y nosotros no, de un solo, directo, ¿ok? Luego tenemos, sí, aunque no lo crean. I've been married for, también lo decimos. He estado casado por cuántos años. I've been married for, ¿qué es la honestidad. So, entonces, I've es la contracción de I have. have. That, that's it. And that's uh, uh, present perfect. Es presente perfecto. Yo he estado. Yo he estado casado por tantos años. Pero eh, es bien común el, la contracción. Okay? I've, I've, o si no, I have, pero si no, I've. Okay? I've been married for five years, one day, I don't know. So that is, I'm divorced. Conté, I'm divorced. Mm -hmm. Porque si ustedes dicen I'm divorced, ustedes son la persona que divorcia a la persona. So, no, no digan eso. So, no, mentira. I'm divorced. Conté, soy divorciado. Y la otra es, I'm getting divorced. Esa también, me, ya, ya la he escuchado muchas veces. Me voy a divorciar. ¿Mm? Típica. Voy a confiar. Right? So, I'm getting divorced. Y uno espera cinco años esperando que termine, ¿verdad? Que de, de aquí pase aquí. Bota. This process can be very long. Yeah. Es como la ley de la relatividad. Right? Well, so tell me one that calls your attention. No. Díganme la, 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 la de ustedes. ¿Cómo dice Carita? Estoy con él solo por... Um, with him just for the kids. 
¿no? Pero como sé que ustedes no, pero si nos van mal. Ok. Ok, eh, Carito en Rachel. Uh -huh. No, me, mencionen una que, que cualquiera. No necesariamente la real. I like, uh, we, are, we are engaged. We are engaged. Yes, it's like, like very, it. it's like very romantic, formal, yeah. and polite. Like you respect yeah. the other person. Como que respeta bastante a la otra persona. Right? Yeah, and, so. and you, and you choose the ring and everything. And everything. And that's it. Okay. Si quiere casarle, no, dice Carito. Eh, um, Rachel. No. Man. Never, 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 never. Tranquila. Tranquila. And never. And, okay, okay. Ajá, Raquel. Eh, Luis. Uh, I've been married for six years. For six years. Is that real? Real. Real. Six years. Real. Six years. How old are you? 28. Come on. You were, you were very young. Tranquila, yo. Yes. Okay, go. But, como decía José José, pass is the past. Pasado. Pasado. Recomiendo José José. Buenas canciones. Eh, Luis, el de Wico. Ok, William. Ok, I eh, am, Luis. I am single. Ok, that's no te van a jalar las orejas, relax. No, de repente teacher. así lo van a jalar. Ok, y le caí el cacerolazo. Ajá. No, okay. teacher. Ok, good. Te creo. I believe you, my friend. I believe you. Ok, eh, Joa en Elisa. I de dating someone. Oh. Ok. Animo. Oh. Oh. Eh, Eli en el carito. Okay. I've been union free for 22 years. Oh, yes. That's nice. 22 years. A lot of time. Tropa, ya se conocen las manías. Ajá, carito, tranquila. Demasiado. Eh, okay. Solo para colombianiz colombianizarlos, eh, Luis, ah. eh, and teacher, how do you say soltero sin compromiso y a la orden? Así ah, es en Colombia. Ah, really? Soltero really? sin compromiso y a la orden. Y a la Qué orden. Amable. Se escucha como una persona muy amable. Mejor soltero <ríe> sin compromiso y esperando herencia. Ajá, esperando. <ríe> okay. Qué estructurado, sí, oye, teacher. Sí, es demasiado estructurado, <laughs> como muy plan, plan, planificado. Something. Yes. Well, yes. Thank you for the info. Algún día, no creo que lo usemos, pero well, thank you. For... <laughs> Very nice. Uh, what about Steffi and Mardo? I am single. Sorry? I'm single. Oh, good. Nice, Steffi. Mardo and Carla. I've been married for 18 years. Is that real? Mardo? It's real. real. 18 yeah. years. Wow. Congratulations. 18 years. Very nice. I like to hear when people people have been together for many years, even they are married or not. Yeah, that's something that it's very, I don't know, very interesting. I, I like to hear those stories. Perfect, uh, Carly, and then we go with uh, William. Carla. Okay, uh, William, are you there? And then Gabriel. Hello, teacher. Okay, William. Okay, I'm single. Okay, good. Hombre Nice. Perfect. Mm -hmm. uh, Yes, Gabriel. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Gabriel, your turn. Okay. I even married for 14 years. I am happy. Very in, very nice. 14 years. Yes, a lot of 14. years. 14. Wow. Congratulations, Gabriel. Me gusta que dice, I'm happy. It's very good. Y sonriente. Como decía un amigo, estoy felizmente casado. Pero enfrente de la esposa lo decía. Ok, so that's nice. Ok, uh, thank you, Gabriel. Let's listen to Oscar and then Carlos. 
I've been married for 21 years. 21, wow. Congratulations. Vuelve a ver así. Ok, nice. Oscar, perfect. Eh, Carlos and Wilfredo. Okay, teacher. I've been married for five years. For real, de verdad. Five years. Yes. Me yes. parece, te Carlos. Okay. <laughs> nice. Congratulations. And let's listen. Gracias, teacher. Okay, Wilfredo and Edwin. Okay. I have been married for 24 years. Okay, 24. Y se ríe, Wilfredo. Okay, Wilfredo. Very nice. Creo que ya nos van a dar un par de tips. No revisar el celular, creo que es uno. Okay, and Edwin. And then Carly. Okay, I am divorced. Okay, that's another part of the story. New beginning, nuevo comienzo. Uh, Carly. And then Patty. Sorry. I'm single. Okay, I'm single. Y le faltan kilos. Okay. Okay, Patty, are you ready? Well, I just know. Um, any advice? Una pequeña sugerencia para los demás educandos, Elisa. Ardo, Gabriel, Wilfredo aprovechando ahí la asesoría, Carito. No complicarte la vida. Ok. A, la, a las mujeres no se les comprende, se les ama. Buah, qué rima. Oh. Okay. Eso me sonó canción. Yes, ¿dónde la habrá escuchado? <risa> <risa> ok, good. Eh, who else? Ah, Wilfredo, oh, Oscar, Gabriel, Carito. Hay que ser obediente. Bye. <laughs> ok, hay que ser obedient. Hay que ser obediente. Muy bien. Eh, yes, Rachel. ¿Qué pasó, Raquelita? Cuéntanos. Que sigan el instinto. Uno siempre sabe cuando las cosas están mal. Ah, seguir el instinto. Ok, te funcionó, ¿verdad, Rachel? Mucho. Sentido arácnido. Okay. Amiga, date cuenta. Okay. Amigas. Miren, qué bueno que la mayoría tiene audífonos puestos. Está saliendo <risa> los demás boxos. Ok, Oscar, eh, Gabriel. I would like to know about Oscar experience. Ok, Oscar. Bueno, principalmente este, la comunión con Dios es importante. Entonces, eso es lo que ha mantenido más que todo la unión entre nosotros. Es, es como la columna vertebral de tu relación. Exacto. Nice. Exacto eso. That's perfect. Thank you. Nice. No lloré yo, tranquila. Ok, en Gabriel, en carito que no se me haga la, la marea. De... Gabriel, el micrófono, porque estás hablando con ella, creo. Ajá. No, exactamente lo que dice eh, Oscar, pues, eh, eh, la comunión con Dios y, pues, respeto, sobre todo respeto. Ok, perfecto. Respeto like para it. la pared. Yes, very important. Thank you. ¿Quién se nos queda de los que ya, ya tienen más experiencia? A ver, carito, no se me haga la... Yo no fui. La idea era recibir consejos para que le dure el matrimonio. Yo soy el ejemplo del fracaso. No, come on, no. Well, I guess we have like. Carito, las segundas oportunidades a veces son mejores, me preocupa. Ya, Carito, hablamos. Pero, pero Carito, ¿cómo que? Maya, como que está frustrada, pero. No, Maya, te encontraremos algo mejor, Carito. First advice. Don't get married, girls. And second, don't be toxic. I am okay. really toxic. So. Really? Okay. Oh, yeah. Jealous, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of. 100%. Oh, a thousand percent. Okay. Bueno, esa va a ser pregunta para 
para otra clase. Don't be like me. Really, carito. Y siempre ha sido así. No. La vida te hizo así. La vida me hizo así, teacher. Okay, well, that is something that happens. Esa Joana. The protein, the protein. Yeah, no, it's true. It's true. Okay. Well, my my first my first marriage. 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 Mm -hmm. Marriage. Marriage. Didn't work because he wasn't obedient. No era obediente. No. Tú querías, you, you wanted a, an obedient person. Of course. <laughs> Por eso es que funciona, teacher. Ok, querido, ok. Bueno, tiene sus exigencias. Toxic, toxic, toxic. Yeah. Thank you, querido. Te vamos a dar ahí este. Eh, you, you say something really important that I guess I am extremely ex ex exigent, do you say? Yes. Mm -hmm. Demanding. Maybe. Totally. Demanding. No oh. que demanda. Bueno, puede ser que vos demande. ¿no? Pero demanding es exigente. Dale el antibiótico, mi amor. Por favor. Yes. That's okay. me. Yeah. I guess that that's some parameters. Algunos parámetros y todo eso. No, no crean. Ya, ya lo voy conociendo. Bueno, ya se rato. Ok, but good. I like to know people. Me gusta conocer mucha gente. Hacer muchos amigos y amigas. Ok, we continue. Se me ha olvidado que tenía más frases. I'm widowed. Eh, podemos decir acá. I'm widow. Pero si decimos widowed, es como enviudé. Yes, my. Especially, eso aplica más que todo pues, para, para las mujeres. Una cosa bien, bien curiosa, right? Pero igual. I'm not looking for anything serious. Mm, no sé por qué puse esto. I'm not looking for anything serious. No estoy buscando para nada serio. No estoy buscando nada serio. Ok. No sé cómo llegó hasta acá. I'm not quite over my ex. Es como cuando ustedes no han superado. Ya saben al innombrable. O la innombrable. I'm not quite over my ex. Esta es la típica, miren. Lloramos juntos. We are just friends. We are just, oigan bien, friends, no friends, friends, sin la I, friends. We broke up. Terminamos. We broke up. Salud. Okay. We broke up. <laughs> My relationship is complicated. Complicated. Como la canción de Abril Lavinch. Complicated. Read. No, open is complicated, but it's complicated. My relationship is complicated. Y podemos decir, I'm interested in, estoy interesado, ¿eh? ¿Qué dice la persona? Ok. Um, mm, Rachel, ¿qué pasó? Ya sé. Ya sé cuánto gusta. Dime. Tell us about your experience, too. My experience. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. About... Sí, necesitamos saber. <laughs> well, I don't have too much experience, believe it. Um, it's like, um, creo que, I, I guess the basic is the decision to take. Las decisiones que se toman. Y normalmente las decisiones son muy emocionales. Entonces, yo tomé, I have taken a lot of emotional decisions, estando feliz, estando frustrado, enojado, y allí es donde eh, considero que hemos fallado. In my case, I have failed a couple of times. I have never been married. I would like to. Me gustaría. Yes, I would like to. Cosa que a lot of the years ago, I, I said no, dije que no, pero cuestiones de, de la vida. So I'm learning how to take better decisions. Estoy aprendiendo a tomar mejores decisiones. Así que, pues, eso es más que todo eh, priorizar, tomar decisiones con la mente fría. Y, pues, sí, el respeto. Yo pienso que, que si hay confianza, if you, you, you provide confidence, 
también necesitas, o sea, no solo dar, en recibir, ¿verdad? Todos, es como la energía, estás y recibes, y cuando algo es mutuo, that's nice. Lastimosamente, no siempre están en la misma condición. So, but well, part of, ya yeah, sé, bien coaching, me escucho bien, como que les estoy dando? But I guess, yes. Pero, sí, mi teacher, pero, este, acuérdense que nada es, es fácil en la vida, ¿verdad? Yep, that's it. Entonces, eh, luchando se, se puede entre los dos, hay comunión. Pero si uno jala para un lado y el otro para el otro, entonces. That's perfect. ¿verdad? Totally agree. Totalmente de acuerdo, Oscar. Good. ¿Mardo? Sí, teacher. Este, hay una, una frase muy, muy poética o, o muy, muy verdadera, eh, ya llevándolo a la práctica. Se dice que se casa uno para ser feliz. Pero en realidad debe, debe, debe existir en, en, en cada individuo el hacer feliz a la otra persona. Si yo me pongo en el lugar de que yo voy a hacer, fel a hacer feliz a la otra persona, ella toma la misma postura. Entonces, cuando, cuando la, le, el amor fluye de, de acá para allá, se espera que de igual manera rebote eso de, de, de A para, para, para mí. Que sea recíproco. Wow. Que sea recíproco. Good point. Very interesting. Bueno, creo que ya estoy recibiendo más sabiduría. I like to, to, to listen a lot of opinions. Believe it. Así que, uxos. Bueno, continuamos, aunque el tema está interesante. It's a very interesting topic. Ok, the last thing. Eh, la diferencia interested y esta es interesting interest, aquí está la clave interested tid, y esta es interesting así como se lee aquí interesting interested, interesting entonces estoy interesado pero interesting es interesante okay? a person can be interesting or a place or a situation ¿verdad? Entonces es eso. Pero interesting solo aplica para una persona. Mm, él es interesado, ella es interesada, o oh, yo estoy interesado en aprender inglés, ella es, está interesada solo en, en mi personalidad, no en mi físico. Él está interesado en lo que sea. Y yeah, así salen los, los sugar y todo eso. Bien. Y tenemos fiancé, que fiancé significa uh, prometido o prometida. No sé. Es, uh, sí, la persona con la que se van a casar. Ah, She is, uh, he's my fiancé. Es una palabra de, de origen francés. Fiancé, fiancé. Ok. So that's it. Interesting. Ok, let's continue. 36 minutes, imagínate. Creo que pasa el tiempo hablando de que el amor está en el aire. Ok, say hello if you are there, my friends. Um, Andrés, no, right? Uh, Carlos. Teacher. Hello. Nice, carito. Hello, teacher. Está celosa, chica celosa. Okay. Edwin. Hello, teacher. Hello there, Ellie. Present, teacher. Good. Steffi. Present. Nice. Gabriel. Hola, teacher. Hello there, uh, Jackie. Thank you, Snow. Patty. Thank you. Joa. I'm here. You are there, llorando. Carly. Present. Nice, Kenia. Oh, Kenia. Okay, Luis. Hello, teacher. Oh, Mar present. Mardo. Okay. Uh, Oscar. Hello, teacher. Hello there, Raquel. Present. Good. Rosita. Bájese. Bájese. Tranquila. Ok. Perdón, el gato se subió a la cocina. Lo ah, siento. yo pensé que... Okay. Yo pensé que un niño... No, no, yo no. Yo pensé que yo... se subió a la cocina, lo siento. Ok. Walter. Um, William. Yes, Walter. Marvin. Oh, no. Wilfredo. Ok, my friends, let's continue with this, porque ya nos quedamos. Thank you. Ya nos quedamos aquí solo hablando de que no molesten en el aire. Ok. 
Would you like to plan your own fu funeral? Funeral, funeral, why? Okay, so what do you think about this? And volunteers for this question? Carito. A ver. Always me, teacher. Okay, it's a short question. It's a short answer. Uh, not really. Just thinking about it gives me an uncomfortable feeling. I could choose the flowers, but that would be it. Really? Okay, so yeah, I don't. You I don't, don't like mean, to talk about this topic, right? You don't feel good. You don't feel comfortable. No, it's uncomfortable. Are you yeah. afraid? Weird. Nobody's weird. It's weird. <clears throat> Sí, yeah. es raro, es raro. It's not like it to prepare your Mary, the flowers, the dress, the, I <laughs> yeah, don't know, that, but that, that, the, your funeral, funeral, no, I don't so, think so. Okay, do you think it is not a good idea, but in your case, right? Okay. Thank you, yes, That's my yes, of course, opinion. Of, of course, it's your funeral. It's up to you, right? So that's it. <laughs> Got it. Okay, Ellie. Yes. Yes. Would you like to plan your own funeral? Yes. I want to be cremated and throw my ashes in a forest. Okay. Mm -hmm. Que las cenizas, eh, pues, digamos, regarlas, ¿verdad? Distribuirlas en bosque. En un bosque. Very interesting. Nice. Um. I I read something like five years ago, something like that, Le algo, in which a person are uh, people are cremated in the ashes and they are like put it into some seeds, some places como, como en, en algunas semillas, right? And you can plant, you can plant the seed and the ashes, plantas la semilla y tus cenizas. So and there is a uh -huh. big but a big tree. And it is I mean me gusta mucho un plan no lo puedo decir todo en inglés okay. pero un plan en el que eh, la entierran en posición fetal y ahí siembran un, un árbol un, oh. una planta pequeña para que la planta se vaya alimentando de lo que usted va produciendo a medida claro, se va descomponiendo claro. entonces dicen de que los eh, cementerios serían unos hermosos bosques y no lugares de tristeza con un montón de cruces very nice very interesting suena como una cuestión Ancestral, son una cuestión así como de antaño. I like that. Muy, I like how it's Muy bonita, pero muy caro. Oh, really? Hazle carito. Pero no carito de Carolina. No. no. Okay, nice. okay, good. Thank you, Elisa. Very nice. Let me have to think some. No. Si no, por lo menos una ceiba voy a conseguir. Okay, nice. Um, who else? Uh, what if we'll listen to Raquel? De Joa. Rachel, ready? Um, if I could know when I'm going to die, I would like to. But since I don't know when I die, I prefer to think about it. You not don't think, think about, about it. it. Okay, Team yes. Carito, <laughs> no think about it. No think about it. Okay, nice. Okay, thank you. Good opinion. And we go with Joa and then Gabriel. Okay. Yes, I have come about and I want my family to please take me to the cemetery. The cemetery. One, many flower, many, many flower, some flower. Um, in the background, my favorite song, Lost in My Religion. Raquel dice que bien aburrido, porque se va a estar aburrida en mi, en mi, en mi funeral. ¿Qué era Raquel Baila? Ok, Lost in My Religion. ¿Sí? That's an amazing song. Ay, me encanta. Yes, that's It's a my really favorite. Really good song. Ok. Thanks. Um, ya le dije que una cumbia le voy a poner. La cumbia rebajada. Yes, ok. Sí. Okay, so losing my religion, we recommend that song, right, Joanna? So very nice. Um, thank you. So Joanna is team Elisa. Okay, let's see who wins. I'm uh, Gabriel, and then we go with Edwin. 
Okay. My opinion is yes. Nobody knows when he will die, but if necessary, plan the funeral expenses in in advance and dies you remove that problem from the family. Another point that is not related to to feelings. Es lo que menciona Gabriel no está relacionado a los sentimientos. It's a, well maybe, but it's about expenses, los gastos, right? Uh, it, it, it's a very interesting uh, point of view in advance por adelantado. Okay. Okay, very nice. That was good. Thank you. Edwin, and after Edwin, we're going to listen to Carlos. Uh, okay. I don't think so. I rather not think about uh, it unless I know I have a short time to live. Yes. Uh, think of some time, not out of the ordinary. Okay, you, you said no, because just like the traditional way, okay? Not thinking in advance. Okay, good. Team Carito. Okay, very nice. Cuando decimos I rather not, ese significa yo preferiría no. Es un el rather, es como yo prefiero no, o yo más bien no. Así es, eso es el rather. El rather se, se, se utiliza para ah, yo más bien, pero que no, yo preferiría que no. Very nice words, eh, Edwin. Thank you. Carlos, and then we go with Oscar. Okay, teacher. My opinion, no. Because thinking about the the end in so much that nobody won in this life. Okay. Team Carito. La thinking about that, it is so, it's kind of weird. It, it is not so, so nice. So you better prefer uh, the end comes. Thank you. Uh, we go with Oscar, right? Okay, Oscar. Thank you, sir. Uh, if, if I like to plan my own funeral, uh, I, I think now maybe pay for a place in the cemetery or pay for coffee for the day of the uh, death. But planning what to hear or what the flow, flow of the funeral, no, at least in so. I think so. Yeah, very nice. So you think that you maybe uh, uh, could uh, plan the place, something very specific, right? For cosas como bien specific. Okay. Very nice. Similar, similar to Gabriel's opinion. Okay, very nice. Bueno, aquí tenemos Team Carito y Team ¿Quién tiene más? Conversation about wood. Ok. So, in this, here we have the first part of this conversation. Uh, let me see. Ah, something, something. Ok. Here we have two conversations. And here uh, we have number one. What do you want to do in the future? Future, future. Ok. I... Siempre I'd como Aida, el nombre Aida, pero sin la última A. I'd, I'd like to be a chef. I want to have my own, own restaurant. What kind of food would you like to cook? I'd like to cook Greek food. Greek, Greek food. Oh, if you do that, I want to eat there. Miren que esto es un condicional. Son dos oraciones. Una es este, subordinada y la otra es coordinada. La subordinada quiere decir esto. Si tú haces eso, y la otra es, yo como allí. Esta es la independiente. La otra es, si tú haces eso, si alguien le dice, si tú haces eso, y tú te quedas esperando. Ajá. Eso significa la oración subordinada, la que necesita un complemento. Por ejemplo, ah, si tú, en el caso de que alguien, no, no hay matching en una pareja, y alguien le está pretendiendo, y le dice a la chica, mm, si tú fueras más detallista, y el tipo se quedaría como esperando, ¿qué? Entonces, esa, esa es la, la oración subordinada, la que le hace falta el complemento. Si tú haces eso, yo como allí. I like that. Me gustaría eso. 
Who would you like to meet someday? ¿A quién te gustaría conocer algún día? I'd like to meet Bill Gates. What would you ask him? Me gustaría conocer a Bill Gates. Uh, ¿qué, ¿Qué le preguntarías? Uh, I'd ask him about his life. I want to know his secret to success. Uh, eh, yo le preguntaría el resto de su vida y eh, quiero conocer su secreto para el éxito. I'd like to know that too. Quiero conocer eso también. That would be wonderful. Wonderful. Ok. I'd aún, aún, break, secret, secret como victorias, secret, y success, 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 ok, carito, could you please send this interesting conversation? Yes, teacher, wait a second, wait a second. There is. Is it? Okay. It's ready. Okay. Perfect. I'm going to check uh, the breakout rooms. Voy a revisar los grupos ¿verdad? para que puedan practicar. Uh, revisen la conversación en este momento. Uh, denme unos 40 segundos. Can I see you? Okay, see you in a moment. Let's practice this conversation, okay? Well, would, would, would you like to meet someday? Someday. Someday. Solo que eh. la moacha no sabía cuál era el papá. La muy zorranga. Zor. Okay, that's really interesting. Yes. <laughs> What? No, delete, teacher, delete, delete, carito, delete. carito, a, a mí me delete, dice como que... Delete, delete, delete. Delete. Ok, we carito. Are... We're talking yeah, about yeah. the previous topic. <laughs> Ajá, carito, it's interesting. Ya me quedo acá. Sí. No, we, le, we le are... cuento. Ah? Very, very sad history. Your, <laughs> your history. Raquel's history. Ah, uh, uh, okay. Six years ago. No, last year. I birth. Yes, three I know. You told me. Ago. Three months. Yes, and my yeah. ex-husband uh, 
ya tiene un hijo. Ok. Oh. De 15 días. Oh, wow. That, that's a lot of information <laughs> process in my brain. Yes. Okay, yes, I can imagine that. But even that choking is be, 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 be impactante. But that's, you, you have to use that information for your own. Tienes que utilizar eso. Como para aferrarte a eso. It definitely, well, definitely, okay. Bye, bye. Right, Carito? Definitely, totally. Porque a veces uno tiene eso. It's very, very difficult, teacher, I that know. situation. Yes. Okay, very difficult. I passed for some similar. And it, it was so, uh, difficult, right? Yes, I, I, I didn't awful. have experience about this, right? But I it's have heard. Awful, I know. Okay, I have heard stories, escuchado historias, and a lot of my friends and my, my colleagues, a lot of people, and wow, that's yeah, it can be important. Okay, yes. but you are young, you are full of life, but you have like a lot of good <laughs> things, right, Carito? It's not, no, no. It's not, it is not easy. I know. Not I know. Yes. It's not easy, but you, you need time, you mm -hmm. need cry, you need go yes. out. Yes. You, you have to, to, to think that those negative out. Yes. 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 yes, you have to. Out. And drink and drink and drink a lot of beer. And, and, water, and water. <laughs> and water. No, eh, no, talking about eh, talking seriously, you need to cry a lot of mm -hmm. desahogarte mm -hmm. and you need time. It's yep. all question of time. But I, I time. don't I don't want to cry. I don't no want. But you, you, you need you, need, you, you have need to. Mm -hmm. You have to do it. Uh, remember that there are different steps. Maybe you are in the step number one. Negation. Yeah, that's it. Negation. Maybe. maybe, maybe you can say no, mm -hmm. no, I accept it. But in your inner part, in tu interior, <coughs> interior, es, ahí está esa parte. Oh, interior. Entonces, ajá, creo que ahorita estás en modo autodefensa. Maybe. Y está bloqueando ciertas cosas, pero. Every person has his or her own process. So, tiene su proceso y su ritmo. Okay. Yes. Hay personas que en un mes, en, en tres meses, han, han superado otra. Hay gente que necesita hasta años. Yeah, so that's different. No, I'm okay. being better that one month ago, yes. obviously. But uh, it hurts. I don't know. Yes. Step by it's step. It's very hard. Little step by, by step, little. Step, yes. Little by little, okay? Don't hurry up. No, 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 right? Something that, yes. okay. So, well, thank you. Thank you for telling us. Gracias, bueno, por partirlo. But you need destruction, as Carito said. Yeah. A lot of destruction. And times yeah. alone, tiempo a solas, uh, a lot of time with people. Yeah. <laughs> Listen to, to, to romantic music and and cry a lot, and yeah, different things, right? That was, my, that was my mistake because I get depressed and crying, but alone in my house, you know, I don't have family here, so it was very difficult. Yes, you feel better. That's... Yes, I understand you, but You're I gonna have made my sister. <laughs> You're gonna make it. And the topic, Surgio, because we are talking about the, the, the question that is very polemic and very controversial. So I say, Raquel, the day that the teacher talk about infidelity, <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's why I, I don't talk about it, because it's very, yes. But, bueno, si estamos más adelante en otro curso, maybe we can, because uh, it is a lot of different vocabulary, right? And that's it. If I am in this group, don't do that. Oh, uh, so you recommend not to talk about it? Oh, no, teacher, no. That te vas, a, te vas, be... hace como unos... Hiroshima, <laughs> nada hace, que hace ver. como unos instantes que te encontré on fire, activada. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Pero qué cariño. 
no. Ok. Ay, my friend. Ok, okay keep on, keep on. Keep, it's okay. Le voy a dar un par de minutos más. Ok, continue. Ok. Ya que no, da, ya que no da, he hecho nada. Give tips. Dale un par de tips, carito. Ok. Oh, sí, okay para sí, no colgarme. Ok, yes. Ok. Go ahead. What king, what king of football you like to cook? I like to cook with food. I like Ajá, yo. Hi, teacher. Qué sonriente. <risa> ya ve. Pues. Bien, tenemos acá, um, escuché a dos, eh, en dos equipos que me escucha, bueno, aquí, ¿verdad? Esta palabrita, kind, kind, what kind. Uh -huh. Nice. So, to, let's see, um, what if we listen to Joas and company? Luis es man, yo soy woman. Eh, qué bueno. Nice. Okay. So, que solo con la conversación number one, teacher. Yeah, please. Okay. Eh, what do you want to eat in the future? I like to be a chef. I want to have my own restaurant. Um, what, como dijo ahí, teacher? Kind. What kind? What, what kind of food you like to cook? I like to cook green food. Oh, if you do that, I want to eat there. I like that. Very nice pronunciation, guys. I like it. Okay, good. Verdad, tenemos restaurant. Yes, great. Very good. Nice. And what about conversation number two? Carly, are you ready for conversation number two? I guess Carlos, right? Okay, just remember a uh, secret, success, mm -hmm. someday, someday. Mm -hmm. So, okay, uh, Carlos, you start. Okay. Uh, al principio, teacher, is would who, who would. Who would you like to meet? Who would? Who would? Okay, who would you like to meet someday? 
it like to meet big gay? What? What you? What would you? Okay, me. Ask him. him. Ask him. Ask, mm -hmm. ask him. Okay, ask him. I'd ask. I. I. I what? No, no Carly. No. Carly. I'd sí, ask sí, sí. him. I'd ask him about his life. I want to know his secretary secret to success. I like to know yeah. that too. That could be wonderful. Okay, nice. Recuerden, secret, secret. Okay, very nice. Uh, now you have this. Okay, perfect. Um, Vieron un par de conversations muy interesantes en sus grupos. Estaban avanzando mucho, mucho. Let's, okay, uh, let's continue. Um, remember that yesterday we checked uh, this. So th there is, for example, these uh, possible problems. Okay, let's listen to some of you pronouncing this. Uh, Wilfredo. Any idea how do you pronounce this word? Wilfredo? Come on, you can do it. Tú puedes. No. Okay, no problem. Let's listen to Carito. Yes, teacher. Issue. Issue. Muy bien. Eh, ¿Y cómo se dice cicatriz, Carito? What? Yes, ayer lo dije. You remember? Scar. 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 Yes. Scar. Scar tissues. Yes. So here we have eh, diferentes maneras. Tenemos Scar como el primo, el primo, el tío de Simba en Rey León. Y tenemos también scar tissue. Ok. ¿Cómo se dice scar tissue? Como esa batería, Lee shoes, Lee shoes. Entonces, Lee shoes, quitémosles la L, sería issue, issue. Así que algo así. Yeah. Ok, perfect. Um, issue significa problema. Ok. So, what is the issue with Robert's computer? ¿Cuál es el problema con la computadora de, de Robert? How does he report problem? ¿Cómo reporta el problema? How does? How does he report the problem? So, uh, here we have some options. For example, new software. Son problemas por los cuales puede... Eh, possible mm, causes for the problem. Eh, no internet access. A virus. No virus. Virus. Por eso, coronavirus. Deleted files. Paper stock in the printer, uh, USB ports, funny noise, frozen screen. So in this, um, we're going to do this. Select one item, un item significa cualquier cosa. Por ejemplo, aquí puede ser printer, impresora. Uh, here you can write computer. Here you can write photocopy machine or coffee, coffee maker, no recuerdo coffee machine, algo que sí que mencionaron. Entonces, mencionen dos cosas. El item y uno. Un posible problema. ¿Ok? Vamos a utilizar, vamos a hacer dos. Right. First, eh, aquí pueden escribir printer, pueden escribir impresora y una posible, un posible problema. Que ayer hicimos eso, se recuerda. ¿Ok? Podría ser cualquiera de estos si es de computadora. Okay, but if it is another thing, for example, the door puede ser la puerta. Stock significa atorado. La puerta puede quedarse atorada. Okay, there are a lot of things that can, eh, they can be in bad conditions in your workplace, mm -hmm. en su trabajo. Okay, so think about two. Piensen acerca de dos. Okay, I'm going to give you like one minute to do it. Another option is this. It doesn't seem to work. No parece funcionar. It makes a strange noise. Hace un sonido extraño. It does not turn on. No enciende. 
o algo que se reinicia, hit uh, restart. Well, let's see some of you, maybe you can be ready. Edwin, are you ready with yours? Aún no, teacher. Okay, no problem. Sí, ready? William, what about you? Ready, William? Okay, Carito, go ahead. Yo tengo una para de lanzar. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Yeah, okay, the conditioner, the, the conditioner air, it does not cold. Okay, it does not cold, no en fría. Yes, the air conditioner. AC. Mm -hmm. the, the air conditioner. Yes. Cool. Okay. Yes, that and that's really negative when you work in this and it is closed in Cina Cerrada. That's really yes. that's a big problem. Okay, thank you. Okay, Luis, solo dígame uno al menos. Okay, Luis, are you ready with one? Okay, teacher, a uh, computer. Yeah. I got block blocked. Se me bloqueó. Okay, got blocked. Okay, thank you. Uh, what about Wilfredo and Oscar? Uh, your laptop is slow. Okay, thank you. Oscar and Carly. Uh, the, uh, the computer, the system, no phone. Okay, thank you. Carly and Wilfredo. Um, uh, phone. And they don't listen to me. Okay, they don't listen to me. Thank you. Uh, Wilfredo, creo que ya pasaste, ¿verdad? Yes, a ver, vamos yes. con Carlos and William. Si está listo. Internet, I don't seem to work. Okay, hey, it doesn't seem to work. Bien, William aparece, I have a, a lot problem with my internet connection. Y eso es, en realidad no es un ejemplo. <laughs> okay, thank you, William. And uh, we go with Edwin and then uh, Gabriel. Okay. Uh, en el item, coloqué uh, el monitor. Uh, possible problems, uh, the computer display blinks one, number one. Number two, uh, uh, the monitor to turn off. Ah, turns off, okay, yes. Okay, very nice, very good examples. Gabriel and Elisa. Okay, problem computing. Uh, funny noise in the CPU. Ah, okay, funny noise in CPU. Nice, Elisa and Oscar. Table is dirty. Ah, okay, it's dirty. Yes, that's also Oscar and Raquel. Uh, uh, turn off. Okay, the printer turns off. Thank you. Okay, Raquel in Kenya. Welcome back. Well, Raquel. Um, the printer runs out. Of, sorry, the printer runs out of e when I have a lot of document to print. Yes. Runs out, se le acaba la tinta, se queda sin tinta, that's frustrating. Okay, Kenya, welcome back to the action. Hello, teacher. Yeah. Uh, light drop uh, by transformer. Y, uh -huh. Uh -huh, por, por la maquinaria, o sea, siempre yeah. tenemos un problema seguido de bajón de luz. No es que no quieras avanzar, es que hay un complot contra ti, I'm sorry. Sí. Ok, nice. Edwin, yes, any opinion, any idea? Eh, bueno, ya, ya le dije el yeah. yes. monitor, pero si gusta le digo otro. Ok, go ahead. Ok, eh, Respecto al programa, eh, programs such a Word and Excel freeze 
from time of time. Okay, phrase se congela from time to time. Very nice uh, examples, Edwin, thank you. Okay, we continue with the question. Would you like to plan your own funeral? Let's listen to some of the opinions. And here we go with Luis and then um, Carly. Oh, okay, teacher. Um, I think not because I would be like planning the time of me did and it is the less I think about. Okay, time of my death. Como the walking dead. So look at that time. Okay. It's the less I think about it. El no menos que piensas. Okay. Tim Carito. Nice. Okay. Está ganando almas. Estoy viendo eso. Okay. Uh, Carly, are you ready? And then. And then. Wilfredo. I wish that he. Is them I'm sorry. I already asked. they won't loud at yes. my erasing that asked. they put funny photos or funny videos. Oh, very nice. Uh, you can project or have like special moments in your life, right? Something when you were happy or sharing time with uh, some friends or family. Go, Tim Elisa. Very nice, uh, Carly. Okay, Wilfredo. Uh, in fact, today one plan is out. Funeral throne, a funeral home playing for the place where, where we will be watched and where it will be built. Okay, so you would. Tú sí lo harías, right, Wilfredo? Yes. Nice, Tim Ellie. Okay, good. Está ganando más almas el quizá. Nice. And Mardo is, uh, is not there. Jackie, I don't know if Jackie is there. Steffi. Okay. And Steffi, no. Kenya, what do you think about this, Kenya? Okay, teacher. Mm, my opinion? Yes. <laughs> okay. uh, I would like it to be very peaceful so that my family and friends would not feel much sadness of my Okay, yes. Another good point, Team Ellie. Okay, uh, I will tell you something that, that kind of interesting that mm -hmm. happened like three months ago. Mm -hmm. One of my friends, well, he's kind of old, just un poquito mayor. Mm -hmm. Well, his father passed away. Falleció o pasó a, ma a mejor vida, ¿verdad? Normalmente no decimos a alguien, sí podemos decir esto, ¿eh? Died, murió, pero eso se dice cuando um, en las noticias. Eh, like, oh. 10, 20 people died in an accident y, y así, ¿verdad? Pero cuando decimos que alguien falleció, normalmente decimos passed away, ¿verdad? Pasó a mejor vida. So, um, eh, his father was a musician. He used to play uh, the bass, el bajo, the bass, um, in the in in the church in the iglesia. Uh, he contributed a lot uh, to to the to the yes catechist, a catechista. And before he died, before he passed away, he said that when he was in the cemetery, he wanted to be with his instrument. Él quería estar con su instrumento. Quería que le pusieran el instrumento encima and then put the, 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 the ground under the ground. Y de ahí enterrarlo con el instrumento. So at night, I went uh, to visit the family. I say hello, my condolences. And that my friend 
eh, ask me eh, for advice. Me pidió una consejo. ¿Qué podía hacer? And I told him, since I am a musician too, como yo también soy músico, I said, well, I recommend you to follow your father's desire. El deseo de tu papá, right? Uh, so I recommend you to put the instrument with him. Que pongan su instrumento y que lo quieran. But uh, he was thinking about it, to do it or not to do it. But at the end, he didn't do it. Al final no lo hizo. Ajá, no lo hizo. Okay. Pero era el deseo que él se lo había pedido. Hubiese sido nice, ¿verdad? Hubiese sido como que good detail. Right? No way. But anyway, things that happen. Así que no, conmigo cuando yo me vaya así todos los instrumentos que no, que no los venda. Ok, so let's say we continue now. Um, 40 minutes y terminamos. Bien, tenemos Mike, Mike Wachowski and Maria. Ok, uh, for this, let's see. Is that, ok. IT department, que es el departamento de tecnología. Accounting. Contaduría o contabilidad. Eh, recuerdan, report, no report, re report. Um, doesn't seem. Si ustedes me dicen sin, se están refiriendo a los pecados. Por eso no digan sin, aunque sean pecadores. Digan sin, con M, como en la tarjeta sin de celulares. Okay? So, remember, sin. To be working strange, como Doctor Strange de Marvel. Strange, strange, extraño. Message, message. Okay, tenemos message and massage. Okay, message es un mensaje y massage es otro tipo de mensaje, ok, así que es masaje, ok, message, massage, message, massage, fácil, massage, ok, y el otro es message, todo es con E en message, ¿verdad? el otro es massage, ok, uh, funnel, thank you, let's see, Also, there's a red light bottom, bottom. Como no sé si viste la película El extraño caso de Benjamin Bottom. Strange case of me. Very interesting movie. Bottom. And so que quiero ver, would like to come soon. Check it. Yes. Right away. Right away or right away. Right away or right away. Okay. IT, accounting, no digo accounting, accounting, report, it doesn't seem strange, message, also, bottom, bottom, so, okay, so for this, uh, let's see, we're going to, well, let's see, maybe, I guess you have this. Creo que tienen esto, ¿verdad? Vamos a practicarlo, pues, un poquito. Um, si no lo tienen, eh, carito. Would you please? Por favor. Ready. Ready, teacher. It's nice, ok. Ah, acabo de ver que ya lo mandaste. Una foto de, de perfil muy sonriente. Very nice. I like it. I like profile photos with smiles. Ok, my friends. See you in a... In one minute or less. Un minuto o menos. Take care, Carito and Raquel, okay? See you in a moment.
Okay, Mardo, what, what, what's up? Pudiste. No has aceptado. Okay, nice. Sí. Okay, Oscar and Wilfredo lo veo bien animados. I don't know what is going on. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So let's see here. Elisa, could you help us, please? Mike and Maria, who is your partner? Who is your classmate? Andres. And... Okay. Okay. Mike and Maria, please go. Okay. Andrés inicia. Andrés. Con Andrés estoy, estoy practicando. Sí. Um, ¿Cuál es el segundo nombre de Andrés? No sé. Oh, Andrés. And Pero Andrés no se ha conectado ahora. ¿O hay otro Andrés? No es única. No me equivoqué. Soy yo, Quiche, soy yo. Ok. <risa> Elwin. Yo, ah, ok. Andrés. Ah, perdón. Okay. Qué mala, Elisa. Ok. Mike. Ya me Maria. cambió de nombre. Ya, eso veo. Qué mal. Eso es peligroso. Okay. Cara de Andrés. <risa> yeah, adore. That's really dangerous. La, ok. La, Action. Ok. Mike. Mike Hernández. IT Department. IT. IT. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from Accounting. I would like to prepare a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Mr. Miss Ochoa? It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes. It says service, also there is a red light on the error button. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see. Okay. Okay, perdón, uh, excuse me. I see, I be there right away. Right. Very nice. Yes, that's it. Right away. Perfect. So I would like to report a problem. Me gustaría reportar un problema y luego, luego sería, I would like you to come. Ahora, esto. I would like you to come. Me gustaría que tú vinieras. Es como cuando le dicen, I would like you to finish the report. Me gustaría que termines el reporte. I would like you to finish your inventory. Me gustaría que terminaras el inventario. So that's the meaning of I would like you to. No significa me gustarías tú. No, me gustaría que tú vinieras que tú 
terminar el inventario en so. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Very good pronunciation. So complete the sentences below. So for this, uh, I will need some help. Uh, Luis, can you help me with uh, number one? I puede poner el A. I want. I will. I will. Yeah. yeah, that's it. I would. I'm sorry. I would like to report this issue. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's perfect. Mm -hmm. So for this and the second, uh, we can have the participation of Wilfredo. Can you help me? I would I fix will. this. Mm -hmm. I, I will. Uh, La verdad es que no está aquí, literalmente. Pero I would, lo acabo de explicar eso, reparar esto. I will repair. Casi. Lo acabo de explicar. I would. Any other opinion? Like you. Like yes. to come. Mm -mm. I would like you to fix this. Por, por esa oración, no es porque esto estuviera. I would like you to fix this. Me gustaría que tú repararas esto. Okay? So that's it. Thank you. I would like you to come. Sí, aparece en la oración, pero no. Okay, hoy no va a haber listening. Sorry. So here we have should. Very interesting question. Should El Salvador have birth, birth control? ¿Debería El Salvador tener control de nacimiento o de natalidad? Okay, what's your opinions about this? Any volunteers? Elisa está con todo, ya va a ser otro equipo. Va a ganar almas. Okay, Eli, go. Okay. Should El Salvador have birth control? Yes. Why to prevent many children from growing up in families in extreme poverty and not being able to fulfill their basic rights? Example, food, education, health, health, etc. That's it. Good, uh, good. Like ideas, how huh? prevent that kids. Um, well, prevent that the kids are not with that lax. Cuando decimos lax, significan carencias. We have kids, the, 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 well, children in El Salvador, they have a lot of lax related to different aspects in life, okay? So prevent that, prevenir que ellos no tengan tantas carencias in general, general like in okay. extreme poverty, as you mentioned. Nice. Uh, Carito, yeah? Okay, I believe that to ascertain a stand it, it's a good alternative to global overpopulation. Uh, the issue of consumption of natural resources and the issue of the poverty. There are people who have up to children and do not have a job. I think it is a problem. That's a real problem. There are like basic needs or basic necessities, necessities that every kid should have. Todo niño debería tener ciertas cuestiones básicas, right? Related to different That's aspects true. that yes, some of you should, uh, you're go going to say, you are saying, you're going to say. It. So that's it. And it is not just uh, for simple things, but yeah, a lot of parents have kids they don't have a job or are stable, un, al menos no un trabajo estable, or with good earnings, con buenos ingresos, and they have three, four, five kids, imagine. So, wow, that's that is really hard. Thank you. Okay, what if we listen now to Carly and if she's ready, and then Oscar. Okay. Yes, so that we don't have um, a overpopulation, uh, sobrepoblación, no sé yep. si así se dice. That's it. Yes, overpopulation. 
that's it. That is something that, that, that is affecting El Salvador because the country is narrow. El país es, well, it's, it's small. El país is the smallest country. Es el país más pequeño, al menos de este continente. And mainly in Central America. So imagine people uh, are uh, constructing more or building houses. They, there, there is something very, I don't know if it happens in some other countries, but I guess in uh, self-development countries, países subdesarrollados, creo que sí. That nowadays, uh, the kids, even they are adults, but they stay in the same house of his or her parents. So they don't, uh, they, they are not independent. They are not so independent. But there are a lot of things. One of them is that. Oh. Thank you, Carly. Um, let's listen to who? Oscar, creo que dije. Oscar and Walter. Ready, Oscar? Uh, Yo tengo una, pero quizás otro pensamiento. No sé si es igual. No problem. Go ahead, my friend. Okay. Uh, well, uh, apparently, uh, the countries uh, has been controlled because when a uh, baby is born, it has to be record in the mayor office in the front there is registered in the contest among a family. Okay, yes, very nice. Lo tomase por el lado de, 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 de la registro documentación, right? And, Exacto, sí. Okay, yes, nice. Como but, censo. Yeah, talking about that statistics, uh, we should have a better statistics in Salvador, right? <laughs> Deberíamos tener como... They don't have a better sensor, right? But yeah, they, they are like, they are recognized and they present to the city hall, okay? Okay. City hall is alcaldía. That's the city hall, okay? Thank you, Oscar, very interesting. Walter, your turn, and then we go with uh, Wilfredo. Okay, I don't know if I confused the question, but my opinion is, I don't know, Sound like a problem is abortion? Well, not, not necessarily abortion. It is a focus mainly for the restriction or limits for some parents to have like control of the kids that they could have or that they can afford. Esta palabra es importante. Necesito que la noten. Afford. Es lo que ellos tienen la capacidad de pagar o proveer. No es tanto por aborto, no es por otra cosa, sino que es limitar. Okay, so when the country, there are some countries in which they present limitation, they say, no, come on. Oh, here we have like some restrictions or here we have some punishment, son como hay castigos, hay cositas así que le ponen ese stop, ¿verdad? Because it's over population. Well, let me see. Okay. What if we listen to um, Luis? Ah, eh, Wilfredo and Luis. Please, Wilfredo. In my opinion, it's sold, have built control, is both prevent pregnancy in adolescent girls and reduce overpopulation. Okay. Uh, Wilfredo mentioned something very specific, uh, adolescents, okay? Teenagers, adolescents, right? So that's really common. Imagine if teenagers are having more and more kids and even they have not finished high school. What can we wait? What is going on there? Right? So it is not just about the money, but the the, the mental health, the emotional part, they are not prepared to have those kinds of uh, take decisions, those responsibilities. Esa responsabilidad a los 18, a los 15, it's kind of hard, right? Luis, your turn, my friend. Uh, 
Then we continue. Okay, teacher. Uh, my answer is yes, because that way children will be prevented from suffering from lack of food, clothing, health, and education. Okay, nice. Yes, you're perfect. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Liz. Very good point. La palabra afford. Cuando le dicen, mamá, comprame eso, papá, comp mm, I'm sorry, I can't afford it. Lo siento, no me alcanza. No tengo suficiente dinero. En lugar de decir, I don't have money, I can't afford it. I can't, no puedo costearlo. Si quiero una palabra, es como costear. No, no, no me sale, chel. I don't have no money. So that's it. So um, we continue with uh, this. Bueno, personal again, Mateo. Afford, afford, I can afford. Here we have a worksheet about wood. I would like to and some other. And here, look. And if you notice, easy, easy. That's for babies, right? I uh, would like, I would like, si queremos, algo, no un verbo, sino que nos gustaría algo de tomar, por ejemplo. I would like a cup of tea. I would like a slide of pizza, una rebanada de pizza. I would like a shot of tequila. I don't know, a lot of things that maybe you can, you, 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 you want, you desire. And I would like to drink tea. I would like to play soccer. I would like to go to the beach. Entonces, básicamente, la dif the difference is, the basically, the difference is to, y aquí va el verbo. Y la otra sola es a. I would like three sodas. I would like five pupusas. Uh -huh. Entonces, podemos agregarle un artículo o un número de cosas que tú quieras. Okay. I would like 10 days of vacation, 20 days of vacation. ¿Quién quisiera eso? Everybody, right? But uh, normalmente aquí llevamos un número o el artículo A y aquí va el verbo. Okay. For negative, la negativa fácil, wouldn't. Okay. Wouldn't para todos. Y para hacer preguntas, como siempre les digo, el, un verbo debe de ir al inicio, ya sea. Auxiliar o verbo principal normalmente es, es un verbo que okay. auxiliar would would you like okay would he like y de igual manera cup of tea o drink tea okay la respuesta yes I would no I wouldn't okay eh, grammar notes para terminar acá vamos con esto tenemos grammar notes me ayudas Edwin number one I would like a cup of tea Yes, wait. Would, would I you like a cup of tea? It's more polite. Okay, this uh, I would like a cup of tea is a more polite way to say I want a cup of tea. O sea que de, me gustaría una, una taza de té, es decir, quiero una taza de té. It's a matter of be polite. Es una, una, una cuestión de ser amable. Okay, so let's listen to the number two. Uh, Mardo, I would like. I would like a cup of, cup of tea, of tea. Et cetera. So okay. Et cetera. It often contracted, contracted, contracted to ID. I like a cup of, of tea in speaking. Speaking, speaking. Speaking, that's it. Al momento de hablar, en, al escribir podemos decir, I would, I would like. Pero al hablar, normalmente decimos I'd like. Por eso es más común cuando vamos a dar una opinión and I'd like to speak. Luego, eh, tenemos, yes, I would. is never constructed to yes, I'd. Fíjense bien. Cuando ustedes van a contestar con algo, por ejemplo, van a contestar, eh, yes, are you... Are you a good person? Yes, I am. Perdón. I am. Nunca decimos esto. Yes, I am. Mm -mm. Lo decimos completo. Yes, I am. Entonces, cuando le están preguntando con algo con would, van a decir, yes, I would. No van a decir, yes, I. No decimos, I. Sino, I would. Okay. Carito, in response 
to an offer? In response to an offer, no, thank you. It's considered more polite that no, I wouldn't. Okay, nice. Entonces, para una respuesta, no, gracias. No, thank you. Es más, es mejor, eh, perdón, es mejor que decir no, I wouldn't. Okay, let's do some exercises y nos quedan 15 minutos de clases. That's really good. That's really interesting. So, I would like, so for here we have, I'm thirsty. Estoy sediento. I'm thirsty. I would like a glass of water, please. Okay, I would like a glass of water. Aunque ustedes cuando están sediento normalmente no piden agua. Piden soda. Okay, uh, here we have. Um, from 2 to 12. The first person to participate in this is going to be Raquel, and then we go with Wilfred. Okay? Raquel? Showtime. Uh, number six. Okay. Um, can I help you? Yes, I would like a ticket to Melbourne. Yeah, thank you. I would like. Perfect. Wilfredo, and then we go with Luis. Uh, number three. Hmm? I don't understand this. Uh, would like some yeah. help. Thank you. Luis and Carito. And number seven. Number seven. My friends. My friends would like come to the party next week. Would like to. Cuando tenemos call. verbos, recuerden to. Okay, thank you. Okay, we go with Carito and Oscar. Uh, okay, teacher. Number. Number four, mm -hmm. uh, Patrick would like to go to the supermarket. He needs milk. Okay, thank you. Two. Se dan cuenta que aquí las terceras personas no, no, no necesitan cambian. nada. Cambian ah, como, uh -huh. como tenemos el auxiliar good, eso no sabe. Okay. Thank you. Uh, we we'll go with Oscar and then Gabriel. Eh, number the 11. Okay. What uh, would you like you do tomorrow? What would you like to do tomorrow? Very nice. Good. Okay, we go now with Gabriel and Walter. Gabriel, ready? No, okay. Te doy tiempo. Walter, and then we go with Mardo. Yeah. Number two. Okay. You need time? Necesitas tiempo? Sería. Ok, te voy a dar tiempo. Mardo, your turn. What number? I don't read. Not ready. Ok, what about if we listen to um, Elisa? Okay, and then Walter. Okay, Ali, what number? Um, number two. Okay, se la ganaron a Walter, okay. Uh -huh. Oh, you uh, I like. Uh, no, yo no estoy preparada, la verdad. Problem. Walter. La misma, number two. Eh, sería, would you like 
our break, yes, we will. That's it. Yes, we will. Okay, nice. Uh, we go now with Joa and Kenya. Teacher, no sé qué está haciendo. Come on. Okay, Kenya. Okay, hey, teacher. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Would you like to see a movie? No, I would not. Uh -huh. No, I would. Carlos, come on. Nine, teacher. Nine. Okay. Would, would you like would you like to chocolate ice cream? Okay. okay. Would you like oh, I'm sorry. Donde era? El nine. Would you like? Mm -hmm. like, to... you like Yes, ice cream or vanilla ice, como el rapero, the ice ice baby, vanilla ice cream. Okay, very good, Carlos. Edwin, are you ready? Okay, Five, no, eight. Okay, number eight. Eight. Mm -hmm. Would you like to work on Saturday? Okay, would you like to on Saturday? Mm -hmm. The answer? No, I would. Would, would not. Or I wouldn't. Okay, not good. Thank you. Okay, and. Vamos a ver. Okay. Any volunteers for number five and 12? Porque es lo último. El último ejercicio. Five and 12. Theaters. Okay, let's ask to Carito para que esté más activo. Okay, teacher. Uh, Está fácil, había agarrado la anterior, por eso. No. Yes. <laughs> Number five. Would Tom to come with us? Yes, he would. Tom like to come with us. Yes, he would. Thank you. Good. Okay, okay. Uh, Carlos, very nice, Carito. 12. Hey, teacher. Would God, would God lie? No, would God you lie? No, no, no. Who would lie? Who would Some lie? Candy. Some candy. We, we would. That's it. Thank you. Very nice. Entonces le preguntan, ¿a quién le gustaría algo, algo, algunos dulces? A nosotros. We would. Ok, thank you. Very nice. Joa se preguntaba sobre esto y pues estábamos viendo esto, ¿verdad? I would, you would, cualquier, con would like, si quieren algo específico de comer o cualquier cosa. Pero si van a utilizar un verbo, vamos a utilizar to. I would like to drink, I would like to play, I would like to eat. Y aquí tenemos eh, igual negativo wouldn't y en pregunta would iría al inicio. Ok, so uh, we're about to finish. Uh, let me see. She was about to have a bird control. Um, let's ask to Gabriel. Then okay. Mark. Ok. Mm, yes. Life is too difficult. Difficult. Besides, we are over populated. Populated. Yeah, over populated. Mm -hmm. Populated. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Very nice. Eh, Mardo. And then William. I think. I think that if you show time the family according to your capacities. Okay. It depends on your capacities. Okay, thank you. Uh, vamos a ver, Kenya, are you ready? 
Okay, teacher. Yes, because there are many abandoned children. Okay, abandoned children. A lot. Abandoned. Of, a lot of. Thank you. Yes. Very nice. Uh, Raquel. Enjoy. Um, I think it will be a very difficult task. And personality, I don't see a way to achieve it. You see it like very difficult, at least in our country, right? It's kind of difficult. Good point. Thank you. And uh, let's listen. William, I don't know if you're ready. Andrew de Joanna. Okay, I guess William has problems with this. Joa. Okay. Our oh, country are ready as beer planning policemen. No, policemen. However, the lack application was due to low education rates, due to deep stay or stay in which we like and cannot be made an obligation to comply with this poli policy as well. It's the case of China, which have established a limit of beer per family. Yes, that's what I, I was saying before. There is a limit, like in China, they are permitted to have maybe one or two, but uh, you can't. And there are the, the well, population, the, the, there are some regulations in that. Thank you, Joa. Very interesting. Carlos and Steffi, and we finished. Hey, teacher. Yes, because it has the control, the population, I be. I bring the control, the economy of, of the country. Yeah, it affects the economy. Definitely, yes. Thank you. And Steffi, creo que se nos fue. So I'm going to check the attendance list and we say goodbye. Recuerden, remember, please, complete the unit for completing desde ya la unidad 4. Ya estamos viendo el Google Live. Para que no tengo más. Um, uh, we are going to have a final exam. Vamos a tener un examen final que lo pueden hacer ya pasado. No lo dejen para el viernes. Porque el viernes eh, voy a pasar las notas en la noche. Vamos a esperar hasta el sábado. Right? Porque el sábado, el viernes se termina esto y si sus notas no, si no han hecho la evaluación para el viernes a las diez y cuarto, sorry, no voy a pasar sus notas porque van a, van, a, van, a, van a cerrar, ¿verdad? Lo que es esa forma. So I recommend you to do it in advance. Háganlo, ¿verdad? Con anticipación. And tenemos... Yo solo una pregunta. Yep. Es lo de la encuesta que mandaron hoy, sería que, como ustedes dijeron, que la diríamos el viernes. Yes, okay. my friend. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Recuerden, viernes, por eso les digo que, que va a ser más... más chill el, el, la clase va a ser más que todo vamos a tener clase pero también va, va, vamos a realizar la encuesta ok eh, sería eso verdad encuesta para el viernes desde ya hagan la unidad 4 su tiempo please. y los el examen también ok que okay, ver um, para la despedida teacher eh, <ríe> prepara puntos artísticos ahí eh? eh, bueno Así que... Todo para la playa el sábado. Vaya, me está invitando. Bien. Aunque sea un brindis a la distancia. Ok, con agüita. Yes. Vaya, Carito ya puso. Ok, nice. Yes, Carito dice que ya van a estar con los flotadores ustedes en la clase. Los trajes de baño, flotadores. Van con el gorrito para... Con el bloqueador solar. Ok. ¿Qué es eso, Carita? I don't know what is that. Se ve extraño. Un okay. cóctel, teacher, no sé. Ah, ok. Tequila okay. sunrise, something ah. like that. Bueno, algún día sabré lo que es eso. Sex sí, ya desea la michelada. <laughs> ok. Ok. Algún día voy a conocer todo eso. Perfect. Ok, I'm going to check the attendance list and say hello if you are there. Ok, uh, Carlos. Hello, teacher. Carito. Hello, teacher. Hello there, Edwin. Hello, teacher. Elisa. Present teacher. Ok, 
Okay, Steffi se fue uh, Gabriel. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, uh, Patty. Se fue Joa. Hello. Carly. Hello. Hello, Kenia. Hello. Luis. Hello. Hello, teacher. Uh, Marto. Good night, teacher in class. Oscar. Raquel. Hello. Walter. Hi. Hola. William. And Wilfred. Present teacher. Okay, my friends. Present See teacher. You tomorrow. Nice. Lo veo mañana. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye, teacher. Goodbye. Bye. Good evening, class. Be good. Pórtense bien. Pórtense bien. Que nada, pues. <laughs> Montón. Cuídense bien y pórtense yeah. mal. Si se portan mal, me llaman. Okay. <laughs> ¿Y qué va a ser eso? Ok. I don't know. Actually, I don't know. Okay, we were waiting for uh, the student who was supposed to be here. Unfortunately, mm, he was not available to this 10 minute session. So uh, we're going to have like a short review about topics we started tonight. The topic is how to use uh, what like to, this is the class number 17. Um, mainly, here we have ways, how to solve the problem, but more than that, it is a causes of 
different situations when a machine or a device can fail. For example, new software, no internet access, a virus, deleted files, paper stuck in printer, USB ports out of order, funny nice in CPU, frozen screen. Here we have ways to report a problem and common issues to report. I would like to report a problem. It does not seem to work. I would like to report an issue. It makes a strange or funny noise. I have trouble with it does not turn on. Here we have a conversation between Mike and Maria. The conversation says, Mike Martinez, IT department. Hello, Mike. This is Maria Ochoa from accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Ms. Ochoa? It does not seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it says service. Also, there is a red light on the on the error button. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see, I'll be there right away. Here we have a worksheet and in the worksheet, the worksheet explains the use of would like or would like to. And here we have some grammar notes, which says, I would like a cup of tea is a more polite way to say I want a cup of tea. I would like a cup of tea, etc., is often contracted to I like a cup of tea in speaking. Yes, I would is never contracted to yes, I. And in response to an offer, no, thank you, is considered more polite than no. I wouldn't. Here we have some examples how to use would like. For example, the, the sentence number one. I'm thirsty. I would like a glass of water, please. Number two, would you like a break? Yes, we would. Three, I don't understand this. I would like some help with my home. Four, Patrick would like to go to the supermarket. He needs milk. Five. Would Tom like to come with us? Yes, he would. Six. Can I help you? Yes, 
I would like a ticket to Melbourne. Seven, my friends would like to come to the party next week. Eight, would you like to work on Saturday? No, I wouldn't. Nine, would you like a chocolate ice cream or vanilla ice cream? Ten, would you like to see a movie? No, I wouldn't. Eleven, what would you like to do tomorrow? Twelve, who would like some candy? We would. 